Today we have a partial solar eclipse because we're not in the path of totality. We've got 85% of the sun covered up at maximum coverage and so we're just letting folks look through our telescopes with special filters that allow them to look at the sun and we also have safety glasses to allow them to look safely at the sun. They actually are basically normal telescopes but with a special filter on the top so that the sunlight is blocked. More than 99.999% of the light is blocked because it would be very dangerous to look at the sun through a telescope without a filter. I think the turnout is fantastic. I'm so glad that we had, you know, mostly good weather. It could be a little less windy. Uh, the beginning was a little cloudy, but now it's perfect. I think that it's probably about 90% UNI community members, lots and lots of students, faculty, staff, coming out. Uh, I think we had a couple people who were on a visit day. We had some uh, a class from Waterloo, a tag class from Waterloo came, um, saw a preschool came, so a few community members as well. So it's important to give like myself as a future educator like an, an opportunity to practice with kids on like something that's fun and engaging that maybe could work out in a classroom or get kids on campus so other future educators or even other students can work with kids and it's just kind of fun I guess. I'm an astronomer by training, uh, astrophysics. So I, for me, the really important and exciting piece is the way people turn out, right? Here's an opportunity to share science with people and help them better understand how the natural world works. Uh, that's the real key point for me in this. Get people looking up and, and noticing the environment around them and then start to talk about the science involved and really understand that we can understand how things work.